I'm not trying to be on no low vibrations. See? <laughs> Hey everyone, welcome back to another vlog. If you're new here, my name is Kyra. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. We are back from Paris. It's been such a long travel last couple of weeks for me and i'm just ready to be back home getting back into a routine so yeah it just felt so good to go to the gym this morning make my green smoothie i'm really trying to be on it like these next three months are personal okay i know i'm always saying like oh i want to work out i'm gonna lose weight no by the time december comes i'm gonna be skin tea okay just got back home, had some acai bowl, and then I had a little coffee, and now it's time to take my vitamins. I love to take my vitamins with um, my meal or after a meal. It just helps the vitamins absorb better. And the vitamins I'm taking right now are care of vitamins. I've been taking care of vitamins for like six, seven months now. I've seen such a huge difference, especially when I came back from traveling. I thought the jet lag would hit me. I thought I would be out for a couple days. No, no, girl. I was literally up and it really does make a huge difference in what you intake in your body so i'm really just trying to stick to my routine so i can show up for myself every single day and my care of vitamins help with that and if you don't know what care of is they are a personalized supplement service where you go on their website takecareof.com which i love because everybody's different everybody's body operates different everybody is working on something internally they just launched their new line of products called gut must and i have two of their products from that line i have the chia flax which i've seen me put in my smoothie green smoothie this morning which by the way tasted so good and then i have the digestive enzymes which is a blend of enzymes that help break down dairy gluten fiber and good health is so important because it's the foundational of all health so make sure y'all are taking care of your gut health because it's so important and i take the digestive enzymes with meals and also with the chia flax you can add this to anything you can put it in your yogurts uh, acai bowl smoothie whatever you do it tastes so delicious this is beneficial to the digestive system and also weight management which we are trying to do over here so love this and i also add my collagen to my smoothie as well so i have all those benefits all of my smoothies so love that so i'm just about to take this right now so make sure you click the link down below and you'll be able to go on takecareof.com and fill out a quiz and you'll be able to save 50 percent off on your first order of care of by using my code kyra 
50. So thank you so much Care of for sponsoring this video. And now I'm just about to get my work done. Um, now it's time to relax and decompress. I have a lot of work to do um, to catch up on. And yeah, so I'm about to get to that. And I'm gonna probably tune in to y'all later on cause I'll probably be, be back home in Wisconsin cause I have to go there for a couple days and then come back so like i said y'all i gotta keep my body up and going so so i'll catch up with y'all in a few Okay, we having a sister day. Make sure y'all subscribe to her YouTube channel. Thank you. Okay, we're on our way to the shy, the wreck. We're gonna just have a little sister day. I had to come spend time with my family, y'all. So, um, yeah, we're on our way to the sh Chicago. Um, what y'all had seen a couple clips this morning, I had to go to Starbucks and I had to edit some a video because um. It's not a video, it's a reel that I had to turn in um, today because I wanted to get it out the way so I can spend time with my sis. I really don't know what we're going to get into. We're going to try to, well, we're going to shop around in Chicago and then we're going to try to find a place to eat and stuff like that. Just vibe out. So, yeah. I say all my checks for this. Oh, you getting me something? <laughs> you spending some money on me? I spent all my money. Per. <laughs> per Ruby. So, yeah. Um, so, yeah. We're on our way. We got to jam out to the music because it's a little drive. So, see y'all when we get there. I'm fucking dead. I'm fucking dead. What's what? the intro? No, I wasn't. I didn't like it. I don't care. What I'm you like? I said. This is my first time.
So I've been on a hunt for this freaking jacket everywhere. And I found it at the one in Chicago, but it's so small. I found it. You did find it. You did. You did see it, okay? <laughs> <laughs> and y'all, this is a small, but let me see. It's giving crop vibes. Do y'all like the crop? But I do have a hoodie on, so it's like it's not even fitting me tight and my battery is dying, but I might just crop copy it, but <laughs> yeah, I don't know. We'll see. Oh, we're at sex and she's trying on YSL bags because lunch is the best sister, so I have to spoil her, okay? So I gave her a little budget because she wants to get a new purse and that's what we're doing, so. She's looking at this. Um, this in a black on black hardware. I think this. She said nice. no. She, they don't have that. Do you like that though? I like my Balenciaga, but I do want this. I feel like this is grown and sexy. Yeah. The big mama. Mm hmm. Both. Ha! Huh. No, I'm gonna get this one. Get this one. That one? Yeah. Okay. Yesterday, I didn't do nothing, y'all. I didn't do nothing. I think my jet lag really caught up to me. Because, no, no, ma'am. It was giving, lay in the bed all day. I was really vibing out. Not doing nothing. Um, my sister wasn't at home. She had stuff to do. So, I was really just vibing with my mom or whatever. <laughs> and, yeah, so, that was yesterday. So, today is Tuesday. I just got off a call um, with my mom. Got to do the important money moves, money things. And now I'm on my way to Chick-fil-A to get me something to eat. There's really nothing out here, y'all. Like, I'm, it's really a ghost town. Y'all can see all the trees in the background. I'm just like, ugh. Like, I'm just so used to having things I'm just used to having variety. And my mama lives like 30 minutes away from Milwaukee. So it's not like it's a big city. But yeah, I'm on my way to go get me something to eat. But y'all, once I go back home, my sister has motivated me. This girl wakes up at 6 a.m. to go to the gym. 6 a.m. to go to the gym. And um, she's in school and stuff. So she's like, yeah, I just wake up early and get that shit out the way just so I can come home and take a nap. I'm like, that's smart. But yeah, I'm just motivated. So when I get back home, baby, I'm getting into a routine. Um, this is the season. This is like peel season. If you want to go get a peel for your skin, go to your esthetician, go to a dermatologist, go get you a peel, have your skin looking glowy and smooth this winter season because the colder months are approaching and it's, the time is now to get your ish together i'm not gonna wait until april when it's like you know time no so i need to get back to a routine y'all i'm literally looking at my old trainer's videos of me and i'm just like wow like working out with him i was literally in the best shape like i was so snatched so I'm like, listen. So we've been in communication and I'm like, listen. I'm coming back. But you need to be real lenient on me. Because, you know, I'm like going to be suffering. And, you know, I'm getting older, y'all. So the pressure is getting worse. Ah. The pressure is getting worse. Ah. And I need to have this weight off of me. I am on a mission to lose 30 pounds. I told y'all this when I went to Texas. I need to go, I need to lose 30 pounds. Like, I can see it, I can feel it. And when I'm like at my best self, I'm like so, I just feel so good. I'm not just ready to get back into my modes where I just feel so good. Like, and I could just keep going throughout the day. I'm just, I just feel good. And these past couple of weeks, like two weeks, my mental has been good. I've been really like motivated to do stuff, but it's just, it's 
weight, baby. Like, yeah, I'm happy. I'm happy and eating my freaking <laughs> life away. And I just, I, I just can't anymore. I gotta switch it up. I know I always come on here and be like, yeah, I'm gonna go in that lifestyle change. But I'm dead ass this time. Like, I'm dead ass. I'm not, I'm not slipping up. We're gonna get to it. Maybe we can do this together. So day one, day one is when I get back home with my trainer. Ooh, I should get Rocky Rock mm. <laughs> See, I gotta, I gotta eat everything that I, I want and then I'm just gonna, you know, bounce back. Should I get Rocky Rock Cocos? No. <laughs> I gotta get out the car. I'm just getting something to eat and then I'm going back home and then chilling out and then we're supposed to go to Taco Tuesday and eat. And we're supposed to do Taco Tuesday and go see a movie but they seen, my mom and my sister already seen the good movie so I don't know what we're gonna see. But yeah, and then I leave tomorrow so. Excited to get back home, get into a routine. And I'm just really motivated to get into it. I was in a slump this morning, not gonna lie. Not gonna lie, but I got me a pumpkin cream cold brew. Excited to get to it. I'm trying to just transition. I'm not trying to be on no low vibrations. See, I can't keep up with these motherfucking trends. <laughs> That's low vibrations. See, I would never, I'm a queen. Just because they give you what's on your plate don't mean you have to take it, okay? That is so funny, but anyways. Um, but yeah, I'm on low vibrations right now until I get back to the A. Oh my God, it's raining. Low vibrations for the day. Per. I don't know who told you you could pop a squat on my leg. Y'all, what the fuck? I have to get this off. No, mm -mm. Today. Not today, baby, okay? Y'all, I've done fucking rain on the fucking girl. Uh, ew! ew. Uh, uh, this just made my skin crawl. Sorry, but you had to go. Ew, that's disgusting. Y'all, I done ran out of gas on the freaking highway. I forgot to put gas in the car. <sighs> this is just insane. It's too many bugs out here. I don't know where these bugs are coming from. I'm just, I can't believe I forgot to put gas in the car. <sighs> Y'all, I was so hungry. I'm just like, I couldn't think. I didn't eat all morning. I had that meeting call. No, and then I'm like, no, I need to go get something to eat. Like, I can feel myself getting hangry. And I just forgot. And I didn't even end up getting no food yet. So, but my sister's on her way. Hope, thank God she was up and out. Because, yeah. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Please, let it be a better day. Please, God. I do what I want. She get what she 
I can't hear my wish she won But she off when you tie me off You know I'm a slum If you ain't close to me, I ain't built like them. It gotta work for me. Just cause I haunt you, it don't mean I want you. I don't. You got some high hopes. High hopes. Nothing at all. Took a trip to London just to hear how they talk. Back to four and no, you should hear how they talk. He might be Mr. Track and Field, but I done ran through them all. Yeah, that nigga played the fool, but just to watch how we ball. I ain't never home for no one. You pull up when I call. All the hood niggas respect me. Strippers wanna sex me. You pressed on her, now we mad because you let me low. Fucked up, don't change it I'd probably be dead if I was basic Would you still give me head if I had patience? I work when I want, I do what I want She get what she want, I call her my what she want I shit off when you tie me off, you know I'm be slow If you ain't close to me, I ain't built like them. It gotta work for me. Just cause I haunt you, it don't mean I want you. I don't. You got some high hopes. High hopes. Hello, it's been a little later. Well, I don't know where this is at in the vlog, but um, I'm taking an editing break because 
um i'm currently editing and uh obviously y'all have seen i'm back working out with buku so he me and him are friends like outside of working out we're just friends like he's just a cool nice person so he invited me to go to um a haunted house today so i was like Mm, I don't know like listen I'm not a scary like I'm not scared but I have this fear like one time I went to this haunted house it was in Illinois when I lived back in Wisconsin quick story time and me and my friend we were with these guys and y'all um I don't know they said that a guy we were with hit one of the workers like on accident and you know you can't touch them or anything like that but they can't touch you but as some haunted houses they are able to touch you i'm not sure which ones but i don't go to those because i don't play that i don't play that she so yeah like he got in trouble he got arrested and he said he didn't hit her but he must have had a little reflex or something where he got a little scared and accidentally touched her and she reported it so yeah that was a whole fiasco and i went to a haunted house when was the last time i've been to a haunted house i think it was with jasmine when i first i didn't even live here yet um and it was here in atlanta it was like this big halloween thing out here but other than that i haven't been um so and i barely even dress up for halloween but i'm gonna try to this year i don't know maybe kim k or something but i don't know comment down below what i should be for halloween but um and also michaela's coming with us because she knows buku as well so um i'm just putting on a little concealer so i look a little put together i might wear some sunglasses um but yeah i'm about to head out the door and i'll see y'all there i guess <laughs> Back, you know what I'm talking about. So we just made it to the haunted house. I'm with my friends. Friend one, friend two. What is this called? So this was Buku's idea. Alright, uh I think this is what Netherlands. You ready? <laughs> what? The Netherlands. Never words in Netherlands? Where's the name? You want me to go take uh take it? No. Oh, it's that. Yeah, yeah. creepy like off of final destination or something the scene with the um, yeah the roster shit i didn't know this was that popping yeah it's popping you chose something popping you're welcome <sighs> don't get scared i'm trying not to i don't have time you don't got any water i think they have uh, they have a fair in the back <laughs> like after we get done with this they have like a uh amusement like a, park like a well, not an amusement, but like little activities. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, I see the little screen. But okay, y'all, to be continue. How scared are you? One out of ten. Um, a twelve. <laughs> How scared are you? One out of ten. Zero. One. You a liar. Anyways. Oh man, stop saying you're gonna cry. No, I don't think you're going to get wet. She said she was. That's daddy. Twerk in front of him. So twerk? Oh. No. The couple pose. I'm 
Okay, yeah, I think so. Hey girl, I don't know when the last time we spoke, but I'm on my way to go get my hair done. I'm just getting another quick weave because like I told y'all before, I'm taking a break with the microlinks. I just really, next month I'm gonna get braids. Um, but this month I'm just gonna do like quick little cute styles. Um, but yeah, so I'm on my way to go to Dallas. She was the one that did my quick weave for Paris. And she did such a good job so i want to side parts um today and also my hair is from sunkiss hair they were nice enough to send me some bundles but i can't wait to try them out and i think they have tapings as well too so and it came with a gold comb i didn't open the package up until today so this is what it looks like so I'm going to see what these bundles are giving. But yeah. And today is going to be a busy day. Y'all I still got to go get my nails done. Listen this. Having appointments canceled on me. Rescheduled. I'm just like you know what. I need to figure out how to finesse this on my own in the house. I need to like practice press ons. I need to practice doing my own hair. And just all this extra stuff. So maybe one day we'll make content out of that. But um, so today I have an event to go to with Amazon. They are showing love to all the black creators today. So that's what's going on. Ali is going. That's all I know. Um, who else got invited? But I can't wait to mix and mingle and meet new people. And it's at Rocksteady and I've never been there before. So um but yeah i wanted my hair done for that for show because first impression is everything okay and then also i love putting a face to people West. to who i'm talking to why is there so much traffic right now it must be lunchtime. well it is 12 o'clock but yeah that's the dealio today um at the light, yeah use the and we get our nails done at four o'clock and i really i've been in the inspirational i've been in like the what is it called? I've been in like the creative vibe. So I really want to do like funky 
cute nails that I used to do like it this set is gonna be so different like I just really want like some funky different nails right now so yeah I know it's Halloween it kind of is like a dark grungy type of vibe um so I'm like you know it's appropriate it's it's <laughs> it's Halloween season so might as well um but yeah I'm kind of running late but but yeah I'll check in with y'all once we get there can't wait because I haven't had my hair done in a minute space for content creators that look like you and look like me and my good self so if you have questions about amp please come see me yes we are home to queen radio i mean mm -hmm. Nicki Minaj is queen radio mm -hmm. joe budden has a show for music lovers only and tanache and little yachty mm -hmm. um and the list goes on and on and on but our mission and our purpose is to mock to democratize radio what's up bitches so i haven't really been vlogging much since i've been back home um but got the hair done um i think i talked about it a little bit yesterday the side part is a little too deep for me but she's gonna fix it saturday um just because it's really like in my face and i really don't like that but it's still cute don't get me wrong it's still cute um I thought it would have been fine, but it's okay. I think it's just because of this, this hair right here. Um, but anyways, I'm getting ready to go to the YouTube lab mixer. Um, there was an event earlier, but I didn't go to that. It was too early and I stayed out late last night. And yeah, so um, I wasn't really in the mood. To go to that i was tired i'm still kind of tired but i'm still gonna go show face um i don't know if i'm gonna stay long there's like an after party and some more stuff um i don't know if i'm gonna go to uh probably not uh, because i want to get up early tomorrow because there's a brunch tomorrow and i just want to get up early get real cute and also i do want to get like a picture um in the morning before the brunch because i like to take my pictures before i eat <clears throat> but obviously they're gonna have photo ops and stuff there so yeah and then also um what happened and then also yeah i don't know oh that's what i was gonna say the amazon event last night was so nice um, it was very intimate. I got to meet some bomb creators, black creators, the ones that look just like me. And they were preaching that they just want to keep um, allowing doors to open for creators that look, you know, black like me. So I love that. It was a good intimate event. I met so many people, so many just, it was just good. Like it was lit. It was free liquor. The link, the drink. The drinks was flowing for sure. Let me just get a ponytail. That's what am I doing? But yeah, girl, I had such a good time. And then obviously in great Atlanta fashion, we went to go get a hookah after. And then we, um, yeah. <laughs> and then, um, yeah, we just went to go get a hookah after, and it was just such a good time. So, I'm not trying to have it round two tonight, because like I said, I do have to get up early tomorrow. So, that's what I'm getting ready for. I really don't know what I want to wear, but it's cold. Um, Excuse that disgusting mess. Can I eat properly? Thank you. Um, but yeah, I'm just about to do my makeup really fast and then head over there. So I'm pretty excited to take y'all along with me. This is going to be my first YouTube Black experience. Um, I've always seen YouTube Black ever since I started YouTube. Like, I remember Queen Naja was there. Dear also met her last night. Well, I've met her before, but yeah, she was there last night. Super sweet. And 
um yeah i can't wait to just experience for myself being a content creator um but yeah i'm just super excited so let me hurry up and do my makeup and we'll be on the way So anywho, I have on, this is my outfit for today. It's just a brunch, so I just got on these green pants, this YSL shirt, this gray bag. And then, yeah, I really didn't want to do too much. I didn't feel like wearing heels. I'm not in the mood. So, but yeah, the um, brunch is at the atrium, which is at the Pond City Market. So, yeah, but this is the fit. So I'm just going to head over there now and then, yeah so i'll see y'all when i get there and i didn't attend any of the youtube black stuff i feel so bad but today we're gonna get all the content so yeah let's just get over there get over there girl i actually didn't even get a chance to go over the to the creator diaries brunch for youtube black because of a emergency but yeah my youtube black experience was obviously a fail and it was just due to me for the youtube mixer my homegirl from youtube did try to get me in um which was her event um but due to security reasons at the google offices of atlanta they had a cutoff time for that and we did not know that so i wasn't really tripping um but yeah my youtube black was a fail only due to my own actions but it's okay i'm just gonna keep pushing and then uh, other opportunities i know will present itself in front of me and i would know not to fuck it up this time so yeah that's what happened so but yeah i appreciate youtube black for inviting me i love everything that they stand for so yeah that's what happened so we're just gonna keep pushing forward um but yeah let's get back to the vlog so today is it's kind of gonna be like a day in the life but girl i don't know why in my house i don't feel like it's fall it's not giving me fall vibes it's not getting me in the you know fall spooky mood that you're supposed to feel you know what i'm saying the only thing that's making me it feel like fall is when i come outside but we all know I spend most of my time in my crib. So, <laughs> so today I really just want to, I have a lot of errands to run, first of all. So I was like, let me just pick up some home decor so I can put it in my house. I want like that branch vibe. I have branches in the corner of my um, living room, but it was just like a tester, but it just ended up being there. But I just want to decorate my coffee table a little bit my dining room table and then you know just get some fall candles some more you know you know the vibes <laughs> so yeah we're on our way to the mall now i have to pick up some stuff from sephora um i want to get some new pajamas like come on cozy season let's let's get into it <laughs> and yeah my fall my outfit is very today is giving very much fall i have on this crunch <laughs> I have on this trench coat. It's super cute. It's from Zara. It's just, it's from their sustainable line, which is good quality for the price. So, and my nails are black right now, <laughs> but I I really want to get like a funky set. So I wasn't able to go to my original nail tech, but um, hopefully I can tomorrow. Wait, he's supposed to be letting me know. I gotta text him. <laughs> um but yeah so we're just we just have a lot of errands to run and we're i'm just trying to get into that fall mood you know what i'm saying um but yeah i'm meeting my friend at the mall now i should not be going up here like i'm not buying nothing that doesn't you know that i don't need right now so um yeah but i do want some boots i've really been wanting some 
like knee high boots only up to my knee and then i'll probably come around and get the thigh highs because i'm a little thick so it's a little hard to find a good thigh high um but yeah so but i have the um i have the what's this called i have the sunroof open because i just want to feel that crispy air because i was in the house all morning so um yeah but anyways we got our way there so i'll check in with y'all once we get to our destination so i'll check in with y'all later so y'all we made it to the mall this thing got me up in here but i've been wanting this coat for so long and they're it's giving out they're giving out gift cards today so you need this <laughs> that's what you say all the time bitch you need this you need this y'all don't this. don't get a um bestie in fashion because they're gonna be like you need this you need this yeah so i'm gonna try this coat on he's seeing if this is a medium that's a medium yeah, the oh this I'm not your hand, 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 hand. I'm not a hanger. I'm not a hanger. <laughs> I'm not a coat rack. <laughs> Woman hug. Let me take time. Yeah. It's pretty fucked up. Let me see it though. Wait. Right there, straight ahead. Yeah. Like two. Mm -hmm. One will be fine. I don't have to order. I can get a one that says it. So we're at Saks and we're in the shoe department. They really didn't have, they didn't have my size in that coat. But I'm going to come, I'm going to stay on the lookout. But I'm trying to find some knee high boots and they have these little taken ones. They're a little different. They're a round toe, like a square but round. I don't know how to explain that. But it's not a narrow, it's not a narrow foot. So they may work out for me, but the only struggle is my calf for those Bottega boots. I do like them because they're simple. I do. Anyways, um, I'm waiting for them to get my size, hopefully. So we'll see. And then we just got to go run our errands. I'm excited to go to Target. I haven't been to Target in a minute. So, yeah. So I'm in Sephora right now. I had to come read up. I kind of want to smell this scalp and body scrub y'all they playing music so i gotta make it quick but this is my favorite body scrub i use it every single day y'all i'm with leah wait hold on let's do 360. show them the face not until it's okay it's okay but the face is giving hair is giving outfit is giving me Every day. Don't play with her. And y'all, she works for Charlotte, so she can't help me with anything else. Okay. <laughs> she said, absolutely not. Anything else? Anything, Charlotte? I got you, but anything else? <laughs> Is this mine? I got you. Y'all, I was looking for the Rare Beauty lip liner. But anyways. We gotta go. Okay. White box. Mm. So I'm here with my bae. She looking so cute. <laughs> y'all, I'm getting all the girls today in Sephora. Period. Period. She was like, I look a mess, no good. She looks so good. Period. Outfit of the day. Don't play with her. Shirt, white box. Side part giving. <laughs> so y'all, I just left Sephora. I met all the girls. Now I'm about to go in for, I mean, for a Um. Victoria's Secret. Oh, they built me a Balenciaga store? Period. Anyways. Um, <laughs> yeah. I'll check with y'all later. Before steering. <laughs> So 
So I'm in Crate and Barrel right now. And this is what I'm talking about, the vibes that I want on my um, dining table. So, but not this specifically, but these branches. I have these branches that I want. Cute. Hi, thank you. But yeah, I think I want something like this. This is cute. Um, on my table with a branch. Ooh, this one is shake. I love a good sale. I love Okay, let me figure this out. Oh my god, this is so cute. Like what? I like the branches and these balls on it too. I don't like that. It's like So I'm at Target now and it's very important to me to have the, the scent vibes in my house. So Glade, y'all, Glade, y'all are sleep on Glade. For Breeze, you all right, but Glade, um, there's a scent that I have in my house, y'all. When I walk into my house, it smells so good. It's called Into the Woods, but it's not at this Target. So I guess I gotta stick to this For Breeze um, wood. And then also, I'm gonna try this ember, but um, I wish they had that in the woods. I might go to another Target, it smells that good, so I need to go see about another one. But is it? Is it? So, I wanted to show y'all how the branches and the pot looks. I think it looks so cute. It's giving me very like fall, minimal vibes in my house. Let me know if I should take away some branches or just let it be the two. Let me show y'all with um, just the two branches I bought from Print and Barrel. And then, um, yeah, so one second. <laughs> And this is how it would look with just the two branches. So let me know. I kind of like it with the whole group. But let me know what you guys think. And also for that scent I was looking for for the plugins for Glade. It's actually called a fall night long. When I tell you my house smells like fall, it smells like fall. And I have one right by my door. So when I come in, it just smells so good and i also picked up this candle when i was at sephora and i'll have everything linked down below so that is it for this video i hope you guys enjoy do not forget to like comment and subscribe i'm not showing myself right now because i don't feel like being on camera <laughs> but i will see y'all in the next video um but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed and i love you so much you can't fit the world in front